Jackson Dedugin is now 13, but at one and a half, he was diagnosed with autism. Hello, everybody. My name is Jackson Dedugin. I'm Watch Fox. Welcome to this orchestra. His brother John, who's 15, was diagnosed at the same time. Um, I drew all the trucks with V8s. You have to show it to him. We originally thought that John was deaf because he didn't talk. He didn't turn his head when you clapped your hands. Their mother, Catherine, says misunderstandings are nothing new with her family. Many people look at an autistic child and say they're just a behavior problem. Um, they just need a, a spanking. I've heard somebody tell me that too, and I quickly told them that spanking cured autism. They'd been cured a long time ago because I found out real quick it didn't work. <laughs> it's a neurological disability, and many people don't understand that. Look at this. Autism is a brain development disorder characterized by difficulties in social interaction, communication skills, and repetitive behavior. Most people with autism have the same IQ range as the average person. Here's why I like the no other radio in Columbia, South Carolina. It's a social awkwardness and then the whole um, being able to communicate. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention showed autism cases have increased by nearly 80 percent since 2002. Kim Thomas at the South Carolina Autism Society says that doesn't necessarily mean there are more people with autism. I'll show you V8. A V8 engine. <laughs> I think it's just that people are getting better at recognizing the symptoms and testing has gotten so much better that we're picking up the cases now that did fall through the cracks. Back at the Dedugin house, one thing's for sure, it's going to take more than a case of autism to slow these boys down. Ready? The king of love. In Columbia, Ivory Hecker, Watch Fox News. with never I'm nothing like if I am his